But one thing I love that you talk about, and it, I think it was actually a couple years ago, maybe even that you first started talking about, but people were like, oh my gosh, 2020 is going to be the detriment of it. I'm like, it's going to, everything is horrible. It's the apocalypse. And, and I loved that you said it takes sometimes that deconstruction, that, that blowing up of things to actually mm -hmm. sort out all the crap that's actually wrong. Are you hopeful or are you still kind of like, oh my gosh, like what's happening? Two things. I mean, I uh, use the word apocalypse. Apocalypse means uncovering. Yep. Right. So in terms of what this time is doing, none of this, none of this that's happening, none of this injustice and inequality is new at all. Right. Which is why my activist friends aren't the ones saying, oh, my God, 2020 is the worst. They're actually feeling hopeful because this is all of this inequality has been going on for a very long time. It's just that now people are finally seeing it because of the apocalypse uncovering of COVID. Um, as to whether I'm hopeful or not, I heard Stacey Abrams say the other day, someone said, are you hopeful? And she said, I am neither hopeful nor pessimistic. I am determined. Ooh. And I love that so much because as someone who's so sober, I, am, I rely on what I can control. And I know what I can't control is outcome. So pessimism and optimism are relying on outcome. But determinism, being determined, that all has to do with our input, how we're showing up, right? So what I know is I am determined over the next uh, weeks to get every single untamed woman I know to refuse being gaslit, to know what she knows, feel what she, she feels, and to show up at the, uh, at the goals on November yeah. 3rd. Amen. Alicia, how, how, are you, how are you feeling about everything, like voting and everything? You, I, I, know, I know that everybody always gets frustrated with people in the, in the music world and the art world, and they're like, just, you know, be artistic. And I'm like, yes, but also, like, I'm not pushing my views on you, but you have to realize how, I think because we've traveled, we see how lucky we are, how fortunate we are to be able to vote. I don't know. I feel like it's kind of your duty as an American citizen to say something like that, you know? I mean, it is. It is all of our responsibility. It's all of our opportunity, and and definitely, it is. It is. It, it, it's something that we all should feel really, actually, excited and 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 passionate about. You know, and we can all learn so much more. I think that's one thing that I think about a lot. You don't have to know it all. I think that's one of the things that feels intimidating. You're like, whoa, I'm not sure. And how about this? And it's okay that you don't know it all, and it's okay to actually start to learn more. I think that's something that I'm asking my friends and, and family and also just, you know, anybody who's, who's connecting with me. Um, like, let's take a moment to actually dig into the parts we don't know. Let's dig into the parts of the ballad that maybe we are a little bit insecure about or the names that we're not so, so clear about or the policies that maybe don't make perfect sense or mm -hmm. that we didn't take the time to look into enough yet. It's okay. It's all a growing process, and it's all a part of actively being a human being, you know, and actively being able to be a participant in what this whole thing looks like. You know what I mean? This is up to us. This is not something where it's like, oh, we're going to hope that that one guy or woman does the thing. No, one person can't do anything all by themselves. Mm -hmm. We all need to show up. We have to show up for our families, for our own kids, for our sisters and brothers, for our communities. Because if we're not showing up, no one else is going to be like, oh, hey, what's happening in your spot? Because I care so much about you. No, we have to care about ourselves. Yeah. We have to care about ourselves enough to show up. So it's less about that they're going to do all this stuff and what and, and we got to show up for us, you know, less about them, more about us. And let's learn about what we can so that we can align with people that have similar beliefs and thoughts. But man, this is for us. We got to we got to do this.